Welcome to Wholesome Sweets. Can I help you with anything? Oh, <laughs> I mean, um, welcome back. Happy to see you again. Yeah, of course I remember you. <laughs> you were in here last week. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, I'm happy you enjoyed them. Take great pride here in making good product. What can I do you for today? Hmm. Well, I guess that's what you're kind of looking for. We have a bit of everything, as you probably have already seen from last week. Um, I just took some muffins out of the oven. Or, you know, we have our, you know, double chocolate brownies. We have a, uh, <laughs> we just uh, came up with this new um, cinnamon cake. Yeah, yeah, it's a new recipe one of my uh, co-workers came up with. We tend to experiment in the shop every now and again, see what we can make. An array of cookies. <laughs> Tons of different pastries, turnovers, strawberry, cherry, apple, all you're looking for. <laughs> oh, we're also bringing out some, uh, I know we have like, you know, our chocolate bread, our cinnamon swirl one. We also have, uh, uh, oh, uh, since it's, uh, well, it's not technically autumn yet, but you know, the pumpkin spice girls are, are starting to make their way around the corner. So we already have some pumpkin bread out. Tastes pretty good if I say so myself. <laughs> I'll take all the time you need. I know we have quite the selection. <laughs> oh, um... I've been good. It's been a little crazy, but it keeps me busy, and that's good. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, the family mainly runs the shop. We do hire others, but mainly the family, I'm sure you saw from <laughs> my dad last week. I know he was, any anyone who comes in and talks to me, he's kind of eyeballing them. I don't know why. <laughs> Sorry about that, if that made you uncomfortable. Oh, <laughs> well, I'm happy it didn't, because I'm happy you came back. Yeah. Yeah, you were very fun to talk to the last time you visited. You come here every now and again, so... But, you know, actually, I, uh... <laughs> I actually really don't know your name. Every time you come in, I always try to remind myself to ask, but I always forget because we get into a conversation while I'm getting your stuff, and then by the time I remember, you're already out the door. And I figured it'd be a little weird to chase you down the sidewalk to ask you for your name, and I just kind of have to hope that you'll visit again. But I guess our, <laughs> I guess our pastries are so good that you keep on coming back, so that's good, I guess. Oh, <laughs> well, it's very nice to formally meet you. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, I guess you already know my name from the name tag. Well, um, still need some time to choose? No rush at all, actually. We're actually a little slow this afternoon, which is good. <laughs> Yesterday was very busy, so I'm actually... Happy to have kind of a slow day. I mean, obviously not all the time, otherwise we'd go out of business, but... Um, <laughs> um, but it's nice to have a little bit of downtime, you know? Do a little bit of inventory, make sure things look spick and span. Brainstorm about new ideas of what we can put on the menu. Actually, if you have any ideas, let me know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, don't worry about my dad. No, no, no. He's as protective of all his kids. <laughs> so. But I, I kind of know why. <laughs> well, I mean, well, he he is my dad, but not really my dad. He's, uh, my, uh, my mom remarried when I was really young. So, you know, he is my dad, but not my dad. But, <laughs> well, he is my dad. I mean, I call him dad. But I think he feels 
the extra responsibility to <laughs> protect all of us because of, you know, you know, just, I feel like he feels like there's a little bit of extra weight on his shoulders to prove himself, which he doesn't need to. He helped us build this really awesome bakery that we have. Mm hmm So, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I wouldn't worry about him. He's just, it's all for show, honestly. <laughs> He's a weenie hut at heart. You know, like a weenie hut junior? <laughs> like uh, from the Spongebob series? Like, used to, I used to watch it when I was a kid. <laughs> well, no, I'm not calling Well, it's like, I guess, not a weenie hut, but he's a softie. <laughs> He wouldn't hurt a fly. He just pretends that he can. So, yeah. Um, long story short, if you have any ideas for any new items, just let me know. And if you're <laughs> too afraid for me to credit you, I'll just pretend that they were mine. <laughs> but I'll give you some free ones on the house since it's your, you, you know, it would be your idea. He doesn't have to know. <laughs> yeah, uh, here, why don't you, um, yeah, if you have any extra ideas or, uh, suggestions, uh, you can just, uh, call me on, here, hold on, on here. Yeah, here, take it. It's my, um, it's my, uh, my phone number. Mm-hmm. <laughs> giving my phone number to a random stranger? Well, you're not so much of a random stranger. You come in a lot, and, uh, you know, we've had some chats. And how else are we supposed to get to know each other if I don't get to know you? <laughs> I mean, granted, unless, you know, you visit the bakery so much that we get to know each other that way, but I think you'd go bankrupt. <laughs> Yeah, uh, you know, just text me whenever and let me know it's you. Well, no, I don't usually give my phone number out to customers. I guess this is an exception. So don't make me regret it. No, you won't? Scout's honor. All right, all right. You know, Scout's honor is very, very it's serious. It's like a pinky swear. I wonder which one's more serious, a pinky swear or a scout's honor, you know? I wish I was a scout. Yeah, I never really got into it. I, um, kind of... Well, I really wasn't into Girl Scouts, it wasn't really my thing. But now I hear that Boy Scouts are accepting girls, so they're just called scouts or something? That'd be kind of cool to learn more survival stuff. But I'm too old now. <laughs> But I honestly wouldn't have the time for it. I, uh, I'm up to my ears and muffins. Which actually, uh, here. Ah, uh, now we had extra anyways. I was gonna put them out as a free sample. So. And you're good company right now. I was kind of, since it was slow, I was kind of left in charge of watching the place for the rest of the afternoon. And you're keeping me good company. So you get a half of a... <laughs> a free half a muffin. Hopefully it'll suffice. <laughs> so, do you have any idea of what you're looking for yet? Any flavors that you're uh, leaning towards? You know, from being in this kind of business since I was 10 years old and, you know, stuff. I think I'm pretty good at giving some advice <laughs> when it comes to baked goods. Okay, no rush. No rush. Besides, that will give me more time to talk to you. <laughs> and then decide if I want to take my phone number back. <laughs> no, I kid, I kid. <laughs> yep. We opened this place when I was just around... Well, when I was nine, I didn't really start getting super involved until I was ten. I uh, it was so exciting, you know, having like a family bakery. You know, you 
see all these cool things that are being put out on the shelves and you just want to be a part of it, you know? Obviously, for probably sanitary purposes, <laughs> I really wasn't allowed too much in the kitchen. Um, but, you know, it was still s super cool to, like, help with, like, what we would put out or, you know, ideas. And, you know, <laughs> when I got older and I was actually able to help bake things because I actually knew <laughs> more about the, you know, protocols and how to do things sanitary <laughs> when you're 10 you really don't think about you know hair nuts and all that other stuff or you kind of get distracted <laughs> and then you mess up the recipe but it's really fun you know it's so cool to see how you can just take these ingredients which are so simple and make something that's so complex and it's just I don't know it's <laughs> saying it's cool just seems way too generic, but it's almost magical in a way. Like, it's very accomplishing when you take out that intricate pie that you just made from the oven and it looks perfect and you're like, oh my gosh, I made this. I don't, I don't think it'll ever get old. Believe me, it can get tiring, <laughs> but Yeah. That feeling's still there after all these years. <laughs> Sorry, I kind of went on a little bit of a tangent there. <laughs> I think it's no secret I'm quite a talker. <laughs> Maybe now you regret me giving you the phone number, huh? Oh! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Well, I guess I have your number now, too. <laughs> Thanks for the hello with the smiley face. Oh, you know what you want now? Uh, what can I get you? All right, uh, just give me one moment. And here. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and here's your card back. And, um, receipt or no receipt? Or, like, I'll just put it in the bag just in case. <laughs> um, so, yeah, here you go. Thank you so much for, uh, sticking with wholesome sweets. <laughs> We really appreciate the business. And your company. And, you know, if you're ever around and, you know, you just want to come by and say hi, you don't need to come in to buy anything, you know. <laughs> well, I'm happy you like the sweets that much. But, um, yeah, you know, just... Well, um, you're... <laughs> I uh, will never be disappointed if you decide to visit. Uh, yeah, that sounds great. <laughs> no, you're, you're more than welcome. <laughs> uh, I don't want to keep you or anything. Oh. Well, yeah, I mean... <laughs> You're more than welcome to eat that here if you want. Again, there's really no customers, so. Yeah. I think I like that a lot. <laughs> I like that a lot. 